We are down to the final four books in our March Literary Mayhem Battle of the Books, and I'm going to tell you who they are right now. Hi, I'm Mary Wilson. Welcome to our March Madness Literary Mayhem Battle of the Books. We have been voting for a few days now, and you have narrowed it down between classics and moderns down to four books. We started with 16 classic titles and 16 modern titles, and there are only a few modern titles left. Let me share the results of your last round of voting. So we had Harry Potter up against The Hobbit, which I was pretty sure was going to be a tough matchup, and it did prove to be. It was our closest one, but Harry Potter was in fact the winner. All right, and then we had Charlotte's Web facing the Trumpet of the Swan. And I thought this one was gonna be much closer, but Charlotte's Web won in a landslide. <laughs> so Charlotte's Web is also one of our books. And then we had Little Women facing off against Hunger Games. I felt very strongly about this one and I was wrong. <laughs> Little Women won by a solid amount. I won't say it was a landslide. It was not. It was fairly close. But Little Women pulled it out against Hunger Games. And our final options were Mr. Lemon Escape from Mr. Lemoncello's Library, facing off against Winnie the Pooh. And Winnie the Pooh won, and it wasn't even close. <laughs> All right. Let me show you how I'm going to score this round. Trying to predict. Only one of my favorites made it to the final four. So this is my score sheet right now. And you can see that the only one I've circled, I actually crossed it out first by accident, is Harry Potter. Everything else has a line through it. So every one you got right at this round that made it to the final four gets four points. So I only earned four points. If you have um, two or three of yours, then you would either have eight points or 12 points. And if you correctly picked all four of the final four, you get 16 points this round. I'm going to be sending out links to my email list to vote in our um, final four, and we will narrow it down to two books. All right, everyone, um, voting will begin on Wednesday, March 27th. That is tomorrow. If you are on my email list, it will come directly to your inbox. If you're following me on Instagram, you can vote there in my stories. Um, and then there is a homepage for the March Literary Madness. You can head to that and there will be a link to a Google form where you can vote. Um, let me know in the comments who you think our final two are going to be. All right, everyone. Thanks for participating. It's been a ton of fun.